everybody, it's Mama D. Welcome back to my channel, Mama D Reacts. And we have the season finale for Vikings. It's been a good show. Um, if you want me to continue the other four seasons, I think there's five, uh, put your comments below. I don't get a lot of um, uh, viewers for this show. So I'm going to put it to a vote. Uh, and we'll see, I think the last, let me look here. Yeah, there were 63, about a little bit under. It's the lowest performing as far as uh, views of the five videos I'm watching right now, which are The Leftovers, um, The Haunting of Hill House, which will be over in one more uh, episode, Ozark, and then uh, I just started Hannibal. So if you want it, the rest of the seasons, me to react to them, put your comments below and we'll see how many people do, okay? So let's get going with this episode and see what happens on the finale. Sweet. Okay. Well, be a little drier, so how's it get warm? If I stay like this, I will rust. <laughs> the fellow is this young boy. There's nowhere to treat guests. Are you the emissaries from King Auric? Well, I can tell you at once, you're wasting your time. It's my land, and I want it returned to me. That's all I have to say. Ooh. He wants to make peace with you. you come to some kind of... Agreement. Then tell him if he leaves my land, we can have peace. But not before. How can you make peace, young no, boy, if you insist on humiliating? If I invade and defeat him, will he not be even more humiliated? Mm -hmm. Not if he finds well. Ooh, the knives. Ooh. I am sure that he would relish the fight. What's your name? Ragnar Lofbrok. You are Ragnar Lofbrok. Uh -huh. The one who sailed west? Yep. I'm surprised that you've heard about that. How are you surprised? Everyone has heard of your exploits. Mm -hmm. Join me. That's probably what he'll say. Tomorrow, you and I will talk again, Ragnar Lofrock. Ooh. Okay. He'll probably make him a deal to come to his side instead of King Hork. She's sick? What's wrong? I haven't eaten in three days. What? Are you sick? I have fears. Go to the seer. Ask if your fears will come true. He is prepared to pay you to renounce your illegal claims of his land. You disappoint me now, but I'm not off broke. I thought you'd come here with a serious purpose. If you would just name your price. The land is priceless. This is not a small plot of land on which you grow turnips and onions. We're talking about a vast swathe of land, and all this land in the earth are minerals, things of great value. Why else would I assert my claim? King Arik resists your claim. But still, in good faith, he is willing to settle with you. If you will name a reasonable price. I have not been given the authority to uh, negotiate in this manner. You mean King Arik sent you here with nothing but a demand? Right. Pretty much. And yet he speaks of peace. Right. I don't know where to send his mind. Well, then maybe you should ask him. Seriously, that should, a suggestion. that should have been discussed. Why don't you send one of your men back so we can put to King Horik my ideas for a remedy? If you think that will work. Good. Your messenger will take several days. So in the meantime, why don't you and your men go and visit our famous ash tree? It's famous not only for its size, but because it never loses its leaves, summer or winter. Some people even say it's Eidrasir, the tree that holds up the sky. My brother Rolo will stay behind. Ooh! Floki! Yep, he's gonna send Floki. I've had strange, disturbing dreams. Mm. Your husband is in danger, but not for his life. He is in danger from the magical world. Oh! The hell, you gotta lick his hand? That's disgusting. I too had a brother. I loved him. We were very close as befits blood brothers. My brother poisoned them. <gasps> Damn! Oh, I only survived because my wife took the cup I was about to drink from and drained it herself in celebration. Dang! I will never forget her screams. Oh my god. It's my wife's screams that will haunt me for the rest of my life. Lord. My brother denied responsibility, but his guilt was too obvious, so I blinded him with my own hands. Damn! And then I burned him alive. Ooh! 
He's trying to put thoughts. That's what I know about the love between brothers. In his head. To get him to turn on. Ragnar would never do such a thing. Of course not. But would you do it to him? No, your brother's different. <laughs> your brother's a great man. A great warrior. As am I. I'm sure you are. And yet I've never heard of you. Ooh, no, that's an insult. Oh, especially for him. He's so fixated on his name and his position. They spearfish. Oh, look at that. Wow. Don't be watching the women naked. You're going to try to kill us for protecting the reputation of our mistress? Shame on you. Are you alone? We're traveling with Earl Ragnar Lothbrook. Then I think Earl Ragnar owes me an apology on your behalf. Hmm? Don't you? So you get your cheek slashed. And now I'm supposed to apologize for you two staring at the naked body. He said that it's true that Ragnar is in danger. Mm. Look at that dog. Wow. Was she supposed to look like Eve? So, all right now. I come to you as you desire. Could I offer you some uh, animal salted fish? We're on our way to see the great Ashton. Of course. You're welcome to join us. Oh, and his son sitting there just watching him. I visited my cousin a few days ago. She had just buried her young son. Why did he die? One day he was fine, and the next he caught a fever. The, the next day, she put him in the ground. Wow. She's got it now. Yep. <clears throat> <clears throat> So she spread the fever, lovely, or whatever it is. Those eyes and those expressions on his face. I hung from a windy tree. Wow, look at for that. For nine long nights, wounded hey. by a spear, dedicated to boat. Wow. From that tree of which no man knows, from where its roots run. Wow. Oh, his girlfriend too. Wow. Why does all the bad stuff happen when they leave? He's enjoying himself in the company of a beautiful woman. That's foolish about that. She found his mom. Flog it over here, she cut his balls off. It's a good thing she's lost. <sighs> oh, everybody at home's dying. You always talk about my brother. Mm -hmm. What choice do I have? He is your Earl. What is it you want, Rollo? Fame. What does you really want? His name to be known around the world like Ragnar. I came to ask about your daughter. He won't sell. Don't you care if the negotiations fail? Oh no! Not the priest! No! Don't die. Oh, their daughter too? Oh, Jesus. I'm Princess Asla. My mother was the shield maiden Brunhilda. Everyone knows the renown of your mother. Well, they're having sex right in front of him? Oh, that's disgusting. I hate you. Mm-hmm. It's disgusting. I could not help myself. Shall I tell that to Lagata, your wife? If you want to. You cannot love her that much after all. No matter what you say. No matter what people think. That's right. I don't care what people think. That's obvious. Of course I love you. Swear to me that it will not happen again. <laughs> I swear to you. It won't happen again. You liar. <gasps> Look at all the dead bodies. <laughs> She loves Ethel Stan. Good lord, the whole town's dead. Man, hire him up. Mmm, Jesus. Oh, and nothing smells worse than burnt flesh. 
I can't believe they're doing that right in front of him. Oh, good. Wake up, Ethelstan. Come on. Is she dead? Oh, she is dead. Look at all them people hanging. Wow. She's yeah. dead. Oh, John. Oh. Jesus. Oh. Wow. I'm carrying your child. <laughs> I knew it! I told you that. Didn't see enough to promise you more sons. But how long have they been there? Yeah, you're in a little pickle now, aren't you? What compromises is he willing to make? None. Can I not eat first? <laughs> what? Did he say? No compromise. He will make no compromises. No deals. He said you must name your price for the land. Or? Die. <laughs> Pretty much. He didn't say or. There was no or. Either you do it or you don't. Seems your mission has been entirely wasted. I have not off rock. Except for getting a girl. You and your men will sleep in the morning. Unless you want to repudiate King Horik. Renounce your allegiance to him. Very well. War. Mm -hmm. oh. God, having to watch your child burn. Well, that's the way they did it back then. So, so my friend, the dice cost. King Harik has left me no choice. I must attack him and claim what is rightfully mine. Your brother will clearly not support me, but the question is, will you? Will you? Mm hmm Oh, Raymond. Not a good sign. Will you fight alongside me? Together, you and I can carve out a new kingdom. Is that what you really want? The death of your brother and the start of your own fame? Yeah, pretty much. Start of his own fame, but I don't know if he turned his back on Ragnar. As jealous as he is. Ooh, he's coming to get you. Oh, you went to her. Oh, for Jesus' sake. Lord have mercy. No way. I will fight with you. Oh, you turn. I will fight with you against my brother. Ooh. That should make for an interesting season two. That was it? All right. Well, we're done. Ah, I like this show. I really do. I like this show. So, um, I vote to keep going. So, put your comments below. I need to see support if you want me to keep 
uh, going on with this series. So we will talk to you later and um, I'll check out all the comments and we'll see what the support is for doing the rest of the se uh, rest of the sh um, episode or seasons I guess yeah rest of the seasons. And please subscribe if you haven't and click that little bell for notifications. And we'll see you on the next video. Peace out.